Flux AI has released a new update very quickly. We had Flux Pro and now we have Flux Pro 1.1, which has made some minor but quite significant changes compared to the previous version. You can create higher quality and more nine websites where you can use Flux Pro 1.1 for free on a daily basis to generate images. You can repeat this process every day and use this AI, which is quite expensive, for free. Before introducing these nine websites, we are going to check the main official website for Flux, which is blackforestlabs.ai. And you can see here, they announced the best of Flux offering state-of-the-art performance image generation at blazing speeds with top of the line prompt following visual quality, image detail, and output diversity. And I'm not going to cover whole of this announcement. We can see here some example images that are generated with Flux Pro 1.1. And you see here they say faster and better interesting one is this image that you can see that's kind of combining the realistic image and a cartoon image which is very awesome i haven't tried anything like this that combining two styles of images together which is interesting and i will definitely give it a shot they say flux 1.1 pro provides six times faster generation than its predecessor flux 1 pro while also improving image quality prompt at adherence and diversity at the same time we updated flux one pro to generate the same outputs as before but two times faster which is very interesting you can see for the elo score flux 1.1 pro is already in the first place and other ais you can see here okay enough talking let's introduce these nine websites that you can use flux 1.1 pro before i introduce all of them i have to say some of these won't give you very high quality images and the images that you generated with these websites are a bit low quality and small size of image files and i separated them in two groups good ones and bad ones in good ones you see anakin replicate and segmind are the best which you can see the size of the image is higher than one megabyte these images have good quality and the other hand bad ones have even less than 200 kilobytes which indicates they are not well in terms of quality you can see the images are very small and low detail but here the image is very sharp and have a good quality and better textures okay the first website is anakin.ai which you can see after you sign up you can click launch app here and you will see the interface for using flux 1.1 pro and you can click here very simple interface you can type your prompt here which i have one you can choose aspect ratio and if you choose custom you can set width and height manually for the image don't forget to choose png because png will give you the most quality of your outputs and output quality 100 and you're good to go and click generate and you can see we generate an image the next one is if you find this video helpful please make sure like the video and subscribe for the next tutorials i'm going to share in the channel segmind.com which is also very cool and it is in group of good ones we have anakin replicate and segment in the home page of this website you need to sign up to access the flux 1.1 pro after sign up click models and here you can choose flux 1.1 pro here you can type your prompt and when you click advanced parameters you can set the seat width height aspect ratio the png and here there's a checkbox if you check this your prompt will be automatically improved i uncheck this and then hit the generate button the third one is fluxpro.art which is very popular and you need to log in and because this model is very new and the fluxpro.art is a popular website for using flux you may get this message that says we are getting too many requests please try again later i try it again to see if it works in this website you have 10 images per day okay again we get this message no problem we go to the next website next website is fall ai there is a prompt section that you can write your prompt select image size landscape but you can see the output image will be sized 
1024 to 576 which is a bit smaller than the good ones you can see here 1342 to 768 that shows these three websites are better for output quality for the next one we have glyph.app that you can see there is a daily rate limit and you can generate 20 image per day next website is rubberband.com and after you sign up in this website, you can come to the home page and here you type your prompt and by clicking on this button, you can select Flux 1.1 Pro and set your aspect ratio and number of images here and give your prompt and then click generate. Next website is Together AI. Just sign up in this website and click get started. Here you can see your balance for each account, $5. Click on models here and you can see here Flux 1.1 Pro. Select that and click on opening playground. Here you can see some of parameters. You can choose width and height. Unfortunately for Flux 1.1 Pro, you cannot increase the number of steps that significantly cause the low image quality at the end the next website is replicate.com which i think is the best site i've used so far for generating images with flux the only downside is that it's not free after logging into the website using your github account you need to top up your account and each image costs 0.04 dollars for the flux pro 1.1 model now I will compare the images I created with these nine websites so you can see which one works best for you. The images I produce using the websites Anakin, Replicate, Sigmind and FluxPro.art were better in terms of file size and image quality. It seems that you can experience the real quality of Flux 1.1 Pro on these websites. The other four websites FallEI, Glyph, Rubberband and Together AI produce much smaller image sizes about one tenth of the previous four sites, which indicates much lower quality. It almost feels like you're not really using Flex Pro 1.1 and are just getting a basic understanding of the prompt. So for high quality work, I recommend choosing the good group of websites, the first four, if you have urgent tasks and need quick image generations where quality isn't your top priority, you can use the second group of sites. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next videos.